Hello everyone, this is Dr. Aparna. I'm a senior consultant uh, and fertility specialist in OSS Fertility, Ananagar, Chennai. So, infertility is normally when uh, there is one year of unprotected intercourse and there is no conception, that's known as infertility. Now, all infertility cases need not end up in IVF. There could be some simpler treatment options also. So, these are the non-IVF fertility treatment options. What are they? One, suppose the couple is young or they are married for a very short time and the ovarian reserve is good, the, sperm anal the semen analysis is moderately good or it is normal in that case we can try for uh, simple treatment like ovulation induction with follicular monitoring so we will give the uh, uh, wife tablets for five days to ten days and we'll ask her to come on day eight or day nine or day ten de depending on the uh, follicles uh, the follicular status, we'll ask her to come on these days and we will monitor the scan. So once we see that there is a dominant follicle, uh, once the follicle grows up to 18 to 20 millimeters in size, we can ask the husband and wife to be together and uh, there is a very good chance of conception with this. This is known as ovulation induction with timed intercourse. And another thing is, uh, suppose uh, uh, they have tried this for two to three cycles and they have not conceived. In that case, there is another treatment called intrauterine insemination or IUI in which the husband's sperms are prepared and they are uh, put into the uterus of the uh, wife. So in what is the success rate of this? Now compared to a normal conception there is 10 to 15 percent increased chances of conception with an IUI cycle. So we can try up to a maximum of three to six IUI cycles usually three IUI cycles beyond three IUI cycles it doesn't uh, uh, help much. So we can try this for which patients one if they are a young couple if the ovarian reserve is fairly okay and if the uh, semen analysis is normal or it is just subnormal say a normal semen analysis is say 15 million suppose there is uh, 12 to 15 million million or 10 million and the motility suppose the motility is around 25 to 30 percent whether whereas the normal motility is 30 percent and the normal morphology is normally 4 percent so at least if they have a 2 to 3 percent morphology so in these cases we can try an ovulation induction with timed intercourse or an intrauterine insemination suppose the semen analysis is uh, not very uh, satisfactory that is the uh, it is severe oligoasthenoteratospermia what we call it that is the count is low the motility is also low the morphology is also low in that case they need not try for these non uh, IVF treatment options then then better to not to waste time and go for IVF now the most important thing why uh, this is important is one we should know when to take simple treatment when to go for advanced treatment that is very important so endlessly a couple should not keep trying no no I will conceive naturally or I will conceive with simple treatment sometimes simple treatment does work like in ovulation induction and a timed intercourse or an IUI but other times there may be reasons where it may not work and there is a condition known as unexplained infertility where everything is normal the semen analysis is normal the wife is ovulating properly her ovarian reserve tests are normal her tubes are normal everything else is normal but still they haven't conceived so in that case also we can try the same thing ov ovulation induction timed intercourse and IUI for three to six cycles and if it doesn't help then definitely they have to go for more advanced treatment another thing that is important here is uh, in this treatment we have to make sure that the tubal function is all right so a tubal testing should be done